Well, it's time now to get another check of that forecast with Olga Ospina. She has been tracking our cool gray and cloudy <laughs> temperatures. That shot behind you looks so pretty though, Olga. I know, right? You know, that's why I kind of pulled it up, but we have some sunshine. At least uh, it's the fake sunshine, but we'll take it, right? I do want to show you that sun tracker because uh, we're past Halloween now, but what is next? Actually, next weekend, uh, daylight saving time is actually ending, so our sunset time is going to get earlier by an hour. Uh, tonight, sunset will be at 6 o'clock in the evening. That means by next weekend, uh, we're looking at sunset time at before 5 o'clock. Uh, good news, though, if you're an early riser, that sun, sunrise time will get uh, one hour earlier. Uh, satellite radar showing us uh, mostly some cloud cover, a little bit of drizzle from that storm to our our north. Uh, it's going to bring us some cool temperatures even this afternoon, but numbers uh, will be warming up as we head into the middle end of the week. We have 80s back in the forecast, uh, even upper 80s by Friday for some of our valleys. And uh, here's a check also of the Inland Empire, the high desert, also looking at some warm temperatures headed their way. For the mountains, we're going to keep it into the 50s and the 60s, but again, Sunday, Sunday uh, that's when we're seeing uh, those clocks turning back and uh, the shorter day as well. Back to you, Serene. All right, Olga, thanks. And we want to thank you for watching KCAL 9 News at Noon. For Olga Ospina and everyone here at KCAL 9, I'm Serene Branson. Remember, the news continues right now streaming on CBSN Los Angeles. We'll see you back here at 4 o'clock. Got your phone handy? Of course you do. Scan this right here. Download the CBS LA app. And just like that, you're connected to all the best local news and videos. Now, if only everything were this easy.